It's exactly 9.01, people are coming. Going to Vitola, I can't believe it is happening. Am I dreaming? <laughs> Vitola uh, participate in this awesome festival, film festival, Monarchy Brothers Festival. I'm really excited. I'm waiting for the red carpet premiere. I've never been to a film yeah. festival. I'm a press photographer. <laughs> Here it is. Yeah, I have a lucky chance to try my first time to be in a red carpet road and to make pictures. This is really great. I'm so happy that I'm here. <laughs> Yeah, we're sitting uh, next to the uh, actors and uh, all these famous people who were awarded on this ceremony. So we were pretty much like VIP people sitting right next to them. When you see the film, it could be pretty easy anywhere in the world. It could be in, uh, in Latin America, it could be in North Ireland. And uh, to me, it's something more important. If you look at the reality truthfully, with a very truthful, naked eye, you're, not gonna, you're never going to fall into a, a cliche. We're headed back to the hotel and we're having a meeting with one of the cinematographers who's doing a, uh, a personal sort of uh, question-answer session with us. For me, lighting is like one of the most key elements in, in good cinematography. I think in, in documentary, when the most important thing to, to work with the light, to see how the light is falling on people, to position the people so that the light is okay. Really important for me where the light comes from, it's like this setting sun so this is the moment when I want to shoot see where, when the sun is coming. And where is this? This is in Finland. It's about a man who is living alone on an island. Mm -hmm. It's kind of part of my job to also talk without the camera. And, and I like to go there before without the camera just to get to know everybody. I like how, we, how he told us about the lighting, how to do shots, how to interact with the, not actors, but the main characters. It's been going amazing and I really mean that because it's not only to go to a place and see a specific movie, but it's like you go, you see the movie and you actually meet directors, you meet the actors and it's amazing experience because you can actually talk with them. And we got these awesome bags. <laughs> Today I, I was just watching all the movies. It was like I was intoxicated with cinema. It was so it was so beautiful, and the people looked really special. Like the people watching the movie, it was amazing experience. Like we're sharing this cinematographic magic. <laughs> we were at the script writing workshop, and uh, we were observing the deconstruction of a script, which I think is a, a, a very amazing look under the covers, you know, behind the scenes. At first we thought like we're restricted to go anywhere and then suddenly everyone started being nice to us. We're journalism students, oh, okay. And then we met the selectors of um, the movies in each section, like New Vision, all the documentaries. And two of them were discussing how they put two Bulgarian movies at one time. So they're like, well, you know, for next year. <laughs> for me, it's like... Mm, maybe the first, my first steps into the real journalism, if I have to summarize this, which is amazing for me and it's big. It's very big and I'm very thankful to be here. We are so happy to be here. It's good. Cinema life. I love to be here. Right now we're getting back on the bus. We're going back to Bulgaria. It was an amazing experience and I hope there will be more of this. I will never miss a film festival from now on. It's just such an extraordinary experience.